value here as the Sherry's Home Heating Service starting gate begins to move for the first. Great action pack card. Here's Vance Cameron. Woodmere Wildstyle, Camco Willow, Dusty Lane Jazz, Kinross Kate, Silver Hill Misty, Salzbrook Coral, Woodmere Angela, top of the stretch. Approaching a start. They're off and pacing in the open air. Dusty Lane Jazz is leaving towards the rail. That's Camp Cole Willow to the outside for third and rough into the turn. That is Kinross Kate. Moving into fourth is Salzburg Coral. Away fifth along the inside. As they straighten up the back stretch is Silver Hill Misty. Then it's Woodmere Angela in sixth. The trailer is the favorite. And that's Woodmere Wild style. Over to the opening station, Dusty Lane Jazz made front. In line to Adam Murner. Second is Cam Cole Willow. Third up the rail, Kinross Kate. Fourth and edging to the outside, Salzbrook Coral. 29 and two opened it up. Racing fifth is Silver Hill Misty. Six up the rail, Woodmere Angela. On the outside, the trailer is Woodmere Wild style. Down the stretch they come in the backfield well in motion. And there goes the inquiry sign to open up this Sunday afternoon. The racing officials have a race one inquiry underway. They have a new leader on by the opening half mile. Salzbrook Coral makes punt for Barrio, the half in a minute. And a one-fifth. Dusty Lane Jazz is second. Third at the rail. That's Camp Cole Willow. Kinross Kate on the outside. Fourth, but no advancement. On the rail in fifth. Woodmere Angela. Then six and coming three wide. That is Silver Hill Misty. And Woodmere Wild Style. She's got work to do. On the outside is seven, but she's rolling now. They go by three quarters. And coming up from the outside. Camp Cole Willow now. Towards the rail. Salzburg Coral. One third. 30 and three was the three quarters, and that is Cam Cole. Willow clear by two, and they're homeward bound. Silver Hill Misty second. Woodmere Wild Style is coming late third. Dusty Lane Jazz fourth. Deep stretch now. Cam Cole Willow. Woodmere Wild Style is closing up. Cam Cole Willow and Gordy Hennessy pick up a division of the Lady Slipper. Woodmere Wild Style was closing up. But run out of real estate. She's second. We'll need a show photo of the trip. 202 flat. Judge's inquiry involves the conduct of race number one after the opening eighth. Well, it's been coming quite a combination. Gordy Hennessy and Austin Surrey, Cam Coelho. We see a lot of action early on. Dusty Lane Jazz has no choice but to release Salzburg Coral to the lead as she comes rushing just past the half, but uh, past three quarters, throws the white flag up to the first over attack from Cam Coelho. The heavy favorite, Woodmere Wild Style, tardy at the start, pays off in the end. She's going to rally up to be second, but it's Cam Coelho. Willow, first lifetime start. Gord Hennessy has her nose on the line first. Well, I got speaking with the Sorries about this filly after they returned from the Port Elgin racing matinee. And they say that she can be eventful. Well, I'll tell you one thing. She is a winner in her first lifetime start, and she's into the winner's circle. Pacing Brown filly, the two-year-old daughter of Westward Ho, Hanover, is off a Camlock Dam Armbro Dandelion, owned by Walter Simmons of Summerside and Tammy Collins of Hazelbrook. Austin Sorry, the trainer. Gordy Hennessy in the driver's seat. The Philly debuts to a maiden record of 202 in the Lady Slipper. That's Camp Co. Willow.